guys, it's your London friend Vasi that loves traveling and also loves her city. But today we are a little bit outside of London. We are at Blue Water Shopping Center and we are here to see the first store of Amazon, Amazon 4 stars. And it is the first location which has opened outside of the US. And we are here to check it out, compare it to Amazon Fresh and tell you if it's worth the trip or not. And let me tell you, it was a little bit of a trip because it took us one hour and a half to get here. So I cannot wait to go inside and see how it actually is. But also this place, it's huge. Like literally, look at it. I was so excited to come in here that I don't even think that it has opened. It's Sunday and it opens in four minutes and we are already <laughs> ready to go in. If you enjoy this content and you want to keep exploring the world together with me, don't forget to like this video and also subscribe. Let me actually tell you where is the new Amazon store and how can you get in there. It's just 18 miles away from London and it's pretty close to Kent. And I want to share with you how did we get there by using only public transport from London. First of all, we had to go to St. Pancras and from there we took a train to a station which I cannot pronounce. I think it's Epps Fleet International. Oh my God, this was so bad. And yes, I know you're so jealous of these incredible views. And after a very short ride of like 17 minutes, we are here. There were just two stops. It was super fast, super good. The only bad thing, it's the price. And in the end, we also took a bus from the station to the shopping center itself. And the return ticket for this bus was £4.40. I'm pretty sure that if you have a car, it will be way, way easier to come in here. But anyways, we still made it with the public transport after like one hour and a half, maybe a little bit less. And little did I know that one hour and a half was actually great because on our way back it took us way longer. It was like almost two hours. But let's stop complaining and get into the store. Are you ready, guys? And in case you didn't know this already, the store is called Four Star because everything in there is rated four stars and above. And it's also like from top sellers or it's a new and trending on the website. But also they take into account the reviews, ratings and uh, all things like that. And this is also why the products change every week. And my first impressions of the store, oh my God, there is no queue, which is great because Amazon Fresh was really full of people. And also when I entered, it's actually pretty small because when I read all the categories that were in there, I expected this place to be way bigger. I think it's also quite interesting of how they actually take the data from the website, like this most wish for books and create a whole section into the physical store. And every product has two prices, the regular price and then the discounted price if you have an Amazon account. But something which I think it's actually cooler is that they take the actual reviews from the website and then they print it in there. What do you think? Do you like this idea? Let me know in the comments down below. I would love to hear your thoughts. Do you guys remember the Amazon Fresh store which doesn't have any tails but it sells all only food? This store, like the Amazon 4 star, it's different from it because it sells like wider variety of products but from the other side like it, you should go and like check out the products. So it kind of makes me think that maybe they don't trust so much their tracking technology. Are you wondering, do you need an Amazon account to shop into this store? Well, the answer is no, like technically anyone could go. But the thing is, if you're already signed up, the prices are a lot lower and there are a lot of perks as well. So I guess this is their way of convincing even more people to sign up to Amazon Prime. And for the ones of you that are interested in pick up and collect, I want to tell you that in store you can pick up some of the items that you see online, but definitely not all of them. So yeah, have a second look before going for this option. You guys, real talk, I'm definitely not impressed by this store at any means, like there isn't anything so innovative about it. 
but something which I definitely have to credit them for is of like how they're managing to make it as more of a kind of premium almost luxurious store because usually when I think about Amazon and the products that they sell in my mind they're always like pretty convenient but low quality whereas once you enter in, in there it kind of gives you the idea of this uh, cool place and yeah just being more luxurious hi Ben oh hi tell us what do you think about the new Amazon store well the experience was quite positive I like how as soon as you enter you see all the departments in the store and you see all the brands and like things they're selling uh, much much more better than like, having the aisle system uh, my only you know, concern is that like I wouldn't have given four or five stars to all the products they were selling but overall quite nice stuff really hope that you enjoyed this video because honestly I'm so tired after filming it and going all the way to there so I hope it was worth it and uh, I will see you in my next one love you all bye and don't forget to subscribe